The need for durable solutions to the humanitarian crisis in the Northeast, occasioned by the Boko Haram insurgency, has again been stressed. Borno State Governor Babagana Umara Zulum reiterated this when he received delegation from United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees, led by the Assistant High Commissioner for Operations, Mr. Rauf Mazu, at the Government House Meduguri. Here is Mohamed Guni with the rest of the story. For almost 15 years, the United Nations High Commission for Refugees, along with other UN agencies and international non-governmental organizations, have been in Borno working with the state authorities to provide humanitarian responses to the displacement and other associated challenges. Governor Zilum appreciated the UNHCR for its intervention in the state and support for the ongoing repatriation of refugees of Borno extraction in the Republic of Cameroon. Together, we shall get the sustainable solutions to our IDP support in terms of protection, the governor who expressed readiness to work with the INGOs, however, stressed need for the state government to take the lead. He also emphasized the need for voluntary resettlement of the IDPs in their ancestral homes to shape the way for closure of all camps. Leaders of the delegation, Assistant High Commissioner for Operations, Raoul Mazau, and that of protection, Mrs. Rubendrini Manik Diwela, said they were at the government house to interface with the governor with regards to their intervention in Borno and commended Governor Zilum for his passion to return of refugees and IDPs to their communities of origin or other safe location. Our mandate is to support government in providing protection to refugees, but also to internally displaced persons and to find solutions. We are greatly reassured by the fact that you yourself are really making the, solute, the focus on solutions one of the main elements of your uh, functions here in, in Borno State. The two assistant high commissioners highlighted need for safety of refugees and IDPs as communities are being resettled in Maiduguri, Mahmoud Goni, NTN News.